Hello, welcome back. Tensor, Carl from Coin Global. Tensor L24. This is an incredible product. L24 was specifically developed for bonding veneer. We've been working on this now for well over a year. Okay, so this is August 2016, past August 2015. So we're gonna put this veneer together. This is a uh, fleeceback veneer, fleeceback, paperback, and we're also doing some long-term testing on unbacked veneer as well, because we're hugely confident with this material. With external testing, I would also add. A, okay, so around the edges, again, as you would do with any normal contact adhesive. Now it's important that when we actually apply the adhesive to this, we're looking for a 100% coverage, okay? So make sure that your passes are nice and fine. This is a very fine spray and it is very close together, making sure that we actually get enough adhesive across the surface and definitely make sure that the adhesive is applied in two, in two ways. So this way and the other way, okay? That's gonna make sure that we get a 100% uh, connection between the adhesive with no gaps. Here we go. 75% overlaps, slightly slower, making sure that there is a, a good coat weight of adhesive across the surface. Again, 90 degrees to the workpiece as well. You can see my whole arm's moving and no swinging of the arm because otherwise you end up getting flailing adhesive. Okay, so there you go. Nice coat weight of product, very, very uniform. You may be able to see that, I'm not sure, in the video with the light but it's very, very flat. Unique thing about this product is, is that uh, we prime coated that off, we applied a top coat. When we put this together, there is a second stage to bonding uh, in the veneer. That is actually the second stage is when you actually come to doing the, the actual lacquering process, maybe a two-part AC lacquer, a urethane lacquer, a water-based lacquer, whatever it is, make sure that it is actually built up. Even if you're looking for a gloss sheen on the veneer as a total surface finish, make sure the layers are built up and don't flood the surface. Flooding the surface of the veneer is the issue in many veneer bonded applications. What tends to happen is that the grain of the veneer opens up, cracks and splits. It also means it, the solvents can penetrate through the veneer into the adhesive causing bubbles and delamination. However, L24 is unique in the sense that it resists against the meltdown caused by two-part AC lacquers. However, if you over-apply ridiculously, it could, have a, it could have a detrimental effect. Try and reduce it, calm it down, prime the coats, build up the layers to get your gloss sheen if that's what you're looking for. Okay, we should be in a position where we can bond this now. Great, again, this product is unique from the sense it really doesn't have any tack. There's no real tack to this at all. It's a very, very tough resin material. Obviously this veneer, as you would know, if you're bonding veneer, it is very delicate. So we're just gonna make sure that we put this together carefully. Make sure it's together. Out comes the 25, the 75 mil 10 screw roller again. As you will see in our Tense Grip how-to video series. Paying particular attention to the edges. So much so that you may even be able to hear the cracking of the veneer. That's the attention that we're looking for the edges. Make sure that you apply uniform pressure across the surface. Don't miss any component parts out as it is critical to the final veneered panel. There we go, perfectly flat. In 24 hours time, she's ready for lacquering process. Remember, build your layers of lacquer up, prime it off, let it dry, apply your next coat, let it dry, third coat, whatever you've got to do at that point, you can start to really flood it and get your gloss sheen, if that's what you're looking for. L24, fantastic, the product that works with veneer all the time, every time. Thank you for watching.